Hey everyone, so this is kind of a quick little review how to. This is very actually important if you're downloading OSX Lion and uh, if you're like me, you like to have a hard copy. In that video, I mentioned that you download OSX Lion through the Mac App Store. So that means no hard copy, no DVD, no USB bootable drive. So if you have no internet, you're kind of out of luck. I heard Apple's going to be releasing a USB version for, I think it was $69 or $70, which is outrageous because I'm going to show you really quickly how to save about 40 or 50 bucks just doing this by yourself. Before we do this, uh, you're going to need about an 8 gig uh, thumb drive. Uh, this one is, yeah, this one's 8. You could probably do it with a 4, but I would recommend an 8. And it's very important that you do this before you install uh, OS X Lion because the installer is like, it self destructs, just like, you know, in the movies. So you have to use the installer before, um, otherwise, you won't be able to get to it and this won't happen. Plug your USB in your computer. Then at the top right, first we're going to open up a program called Disk Utility. At the top right, in the search spotlight, disk utility, open that up. Right here on the left hand side, find your thumb drive, click it, click, 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 and then go to partition up there, right? Make sure it's your thumb drive. Don't partition out another hard drive because then you will be sorely, sorely out of luck. And the volume scheme, do one. Let's just call it OSX Lion, just because that's what it's going to be called, and hit apply. Um, before you hit apply, make sure there's nothing important on that because it's going to go bye bye. Formatting, formatting. Partition complete. Now you're almost there. Okay, let's zoom out really quickly. Now what you're going to need to do is go to your applications folder and you're going to look for the installer file for OSX Lion. As you can see, it's right there. So you're going to click it, right click it, go to show package contents. Okay? It's going to open up another window. You're going to go to contents, shared support, and look for install ESD.DMG. Don't click it or anything like that. So move this over. So you're going to have the disk utility open and this folder. You're going to click it and hold it and drag it into this window right here. Okay? Pretty simple. We're going to make the, uh, the, the thumb drive bootable. So what we're going to do is we're going to click where it says OSX line. I'll zoom in for you again. We're going to click OSX line, right? And then we're going to go to restore at the top right. For source, we're going to drag this over into here. And then for destination, we're going to drag this over. Okay? And then we're gonna re you can't drag it from the window. You have to. That's why you have to put it right here. That's why I did that. And then hit restore, hit erase, and then you're gonna have to type in your password for your computer, your admin password, and it's going to do. Um, a, a, basically, it's gonna restore your thumb drive to a, a bootable drive. And then when you want to boot from OS X Lion or restore, you restart your computer and then hold the Option button when it does that whole chime thing, you know, the legendary, this noise right here. When it does that, you hold the option button and it'll give you the option of booting from the OSX uh, Lion thumb drive that you just made. There's other ways of doing it with a DVD. I prefer the thumb drive just because it's smaller and more compact and that's the same word twice. I just wanted to show you guys this because, I mean, $70 for making, for the convenience of them giving it to you, you could save. I mean, you could get these on Amazon, Newegg, anything like that. Uh, for like 20 bucks so you save you know 40 50 bucks even with shipping so i hope this helped you um good luck and uh i will see you next time